Okay, so the last yard you want to talk about today is 80 yards. Um, again, you know, similar type concept. Um, two shots, tight pin, a little bit of spin. I still feel like I can spin my 58 degree wedge uh, from 80 yards. Uh, great to front pins and uh, to the back pin, we're going to go with a gap wedge. We're going to play that little slightly lower shot, one hop kind of check, um, you know, better shot to back pins. Um, you know, one of the key things as we've talked about these three yardages is realizing that um, we really want to control our distance by controlling how far up and down we grip the club and how far back our arm swing goes. We really don't want to change rhythm in any shape or form. Uh, I don't like seeing guys taking a big long back swing and then trying to decelerate and the impact. We want to keep our rhythm the same and that's why we kind of use different lofts and we, and we control our arm swing. So let's start with a 58 from 80 yards. It's kind of about a, a chest high type feel for me, keeping that nice rhythm. Should be able to get some grip from this yardage still. And as we flip to the 52, this is going to be really become much more of a feel shot, you know, it's just an extended pitch shot. So I'm using my eyes, I'm really trying to feel the shot. You know, my arm swing's probably not going to go much above my kind of middle of my stomach. And it really is just going to be a feel shot. It's going to fly much lower. It's going to have a much bigger first bounce and get back to those back pins easier. So, pretty much got those three yardages covered. We got two shots for each. Trajectory, high, low, controlling that spin.